Meanwhile, Minnesota drew a contender for the 2020 race for the White House tonight. Mike Bloomberg is running fourth among Democrats in the latest average of national polls. WCCO's Esme Murphy spoke to the former New York mayor, who, like President Donald Trump, is investing heavily in Minnesota. If, if you don't vote for Amy, vote for me. With a nod to Senator Amy Klobuchar, former New York Mayor Mike Bloomberg says he is all in in Minnesota, the state Donald Trump almost won. And we can't take states like Minnesota for granted because our margin of victory here was uh, we won it was only 44,000 votes, and that's why we're not waiting to organize. Bloomberg opened this downtown office, the first of eight campaign offices he will have in the state. As president, Mike will provide universal access to affordable health care. Campaign finance filings show in two months, Bloomberg, who was worth an estimated $60 billion, has spent a quarter of a billion dollars mostly on campaign ads, ads that show he is already aiming at the general election. So let me make it clear. I am running to defeat Donald Trump. Bloomberg is just the latest presidential candidate to campaign here. Senator Klobuchar, of course, announced here. Senator Elizabeth Warren had her biggest campaign crowd to date here this summer. And Senator Bernie Sanders has visited repeatedly. We are going to win this state. And so has President Trump, whose national campaign spokesperson says he will be back. States today will be back in Minnesota. We are absolutely investing in the state, and we are making a heavy play for the state of Minnesota. Now, unlike Bloomberg, some moderate Democrats have avoided Minnesota, and that almost certainly has to ch be chalked up to the popularity of Senator Amy Klobuchar. Joe Biden has not campaigned at mm -hmm. all here, Amelia, and Pete Buttigieg has only been here for a private fundraiser. Well, if Bloomberg's uh, trending fourth in the polls, Amy Klobuchar is in fifth, right? In so some of these ahead. national polls, he is definitely ahead of her, absolutely. All right. Thanks, all right. Esme. Well, Minnesota's first presidential primary in decades is on March 3rd. Super Tuesday is now less than 40 days away.